Guys, we're doing the best chef wind challenge and I'm super excited. Who's um, going to be the best chef, guys? Me. What do you think? Me. Definitely and this me. challenge is inspired by, what have you guys been watching all school holidays? Nailed, Nailed it. it! But first, we need to do a challenge to decide who gets to choose what okay. cake they'll be making first. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Awesome. Let's go. Ready? Where are we going? <laughs> uh, to Mars. <laughs> That's so mean, racing someone in a car. He asked for it. We're going super slow. Right? <laughs> Grabbing the camera. Okay, guys. So I'm gonna give you both a treat. Okay. Okay. Why have we got a don't dog eat, treat? Don't eat it yet. For a second, I thought it was a. What dog. do you mean yet? <laughs> it's, not a, it's not a kid treat. It's a dog treat. For a second, I thought it was a kid treat. Nope. Okay. So for this one, poor Remy, he's gonna wait here, and you guys are gonna go and hide his cookie. Whoever's cookie he finds first is the winner. Okay, how much time have we got? Alright, so you've got 20 seconds to go hide it and then I'm going to let Remy go and whoever he finds first, they're the winner. So this is where we're going to let Remy go from. So okay. right here, this white line here. So you can hide it wherever you want but it has to be hidden. Okay. Okay, are you ready? You've got 20 seconds. No, that's not hidden. No. There we go. That doesn't count. 20 seconds starts now. Go! Oh, oh that's my camera. <laughs> okay. okay, hello to Presley hiding dog tree. Here is my dog treat. I have no idea where to hide it though. Okay guys, so I'm gonna hide it like somewhere pretty obvious, but not too obvious so the bag doesn't tell me off. Should I hide it in these things here? Because then Remy will like run over here, but I've got a better tactic. I'm gonna hide it. I'm gonna hide it here. Okay, so previously, Shala asked Beck, um, does this count as a hiding spot? I hope I got it in a good spot, guys. And show Remy where she was going to hide it. And then she said, no, I won't hide it there. So I'm thinking, Five, just there. Four, three, two, one. Done! Ding, ding, ding! Pardon? Presley uh, cheated. How did he, he cheat? Said, you have to hide it I anywhere showed, in the playground. I showed him, I showed Remy where it was. Well, now you're showing mine, him where it was. For mine. Uh, but I didn't hide it there, and now Presley hid it there. All right, well, I'm going to let Remy go from the middle of the park. All right, we're no, going to let Remy go from the middle. that's not the rules. That's cheating. Beck, it wasn't the rules. I did say we're going to let him go from this white line here. Right, I'm letting Remy go from here. Are you ready? All right, Empire fan, Beck wants to change the rules. She's adding a twist, and she's going to let Remy go from the centre. Let us know, guys, in the comments below if you think that's a fair twist. No. Or if you think it's unfair. I think Pres thinks it's unfair. It is fair. Charlie thinks it's fair. How do you, how do you feel about the twist, Pres? hate it. Absolutely hate it. All right, Not well, fair. I'll, I'll go from here. Three, okay. two, one. Where's your treat? 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 Oh, look at him go, guys. He's looking. Oh, Charlie, is that your treat? Oh, no, Prez. That's, that's cheating. You said that's she right. just put it on the floor. It was behind the pole. It's on the floor. How long it takes him to find the other one? Oh, look, he's, he oh, knows the other one's there. Where's the other one, Rem? Where's the other treat, Remy? No, that's oh my fair. gosh, he knows. Whoa, look, look, look. Remy, yeah. where's the other treat? Where's your treat? Oh, 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 oh he gosh. worked it out. Oh, he's so close. Yes! <laughs> okay, Empire Fam, seeing as Charlotte won that challenge first, Wait, she, can you just take, have a look at that? <laughs> I'm trying to get my head into the camera. No. I'm like, well, anyone you... would think that they've never been on camera before. They're just trying to get on. They're like photo on their own vlogs. It's so weird. So Charlotte won that challenge, which means she gets to pick out of the hat first. <laughs> you guys look like Sharpay and Ryan from high school. <laughs> <laughs> guys, we actually went to that musical the other day. We took the kids and it was awesome. We'll show you guys some of the footage from it. Gonna bop, 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 bop to the top. Alright Empire Fam, these are the designs that Beck and I picked. Oh, I said I had fancy Nancy, so you guys picking that really tricky fancy Nancy. Oh, can we show the Empire Fam some pictures of Charlie at her fancy no! Nancy party? Shelly, please! You guys look so hard on that cake. Charlotte loves Let me fancy Nancy. Nancy. Chachi, I love you. I really want the Empire Fam to see just how cute you were. No! All right, so we've only got four. We've got one. Oh, that's like the Elmo game that I had. Number two. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, SpongeBob. I really want that SpongeBob one, guys. That's so fake, though. That's so hard, guys. No, that's actually someone's done that. And that's number four. Oh. 
That looks so cool, guys. I want either number three or number four. Charlotte, so since you won the challenge with Remy, you get to pick out of the hat first, and whatever number you pick will determine what cake you need to reproduce. Yeah. Okay, guys, so I've just got one, one, two, three, four, all written there. Okay. Right. But before we do that, which cake design are you hoping to get? I'm hoping to get the unicorn one or the minion one. I really want to do the cookie monster one. What do you think might go wrong in today's challenge? Everything. <laughs> I think maybe like I might put the wrong food coloring in the wrong bowl or something. Do you think your cake will look similar to the photo or completely different? Completely different. You don't think you're gonna nail it? No. In a good way? Are we allowed to like add a little bit of a twist? Yes, it's your cake. But remember, it has to match the picture as closely as possible. Who's going to win the challenge? Me. Me? Well, you don't sound very confident. Oh, sibling love. You guys are the cutest. No, don't go too far. <laughs> okay, Cha Cha, let's see which cake you're getting. You ready? Yeah. Three, two, go. Oh, what is it? Four! Four, guys! You got four! I got do you remember what it was? It's the unicorn cake. That is one of the ones oh, that I wanted. That's the one Presley wanted. No, I wanted the Cookie Monster one. Okay, All right, Pres. Gonna hold that one high for Pres. What's this shuffle? Is that like a good luck shuffle? Oh, three. What's you the one? Spongebob cake. Under the sea. Spongebob Squarepants. Oh, that's the one I wanted. Yeah, that's the one I wanted. So what's the cringiest meme I could put in after that? Um. I have banana peel on the ground. I'm gonna see if it's really slippery like it is in the cartoon. Keeping in mind it takes about 40 minutes for the cake to bake. I think two hours maximum. Two hours. That okay. is baking and decorating time. There's gonna be lots of challenges along the way, guys, so you can gain time and lose time. So are you ready? First challenge is the shopping challenge. Any mask is go. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong way! You can't drop her off. <laughs> Press. Toodles. Press. You can't drive. Guys, we're trying to go for like a nailed it sort of style with this. I am a little bit nervous because like how to do a sponge out of a cake. I have to have like the hardest unicorn cake, guys. Should I make a sponge cake? But I really wanted the SpongeBob cake. Like it looks actually pretty easy. Huh? But do I have to like wrap it in fondant? My last experience with fondant was not good. I think I'll make my pineapple flavored, a pineapple flavored cake. Ooh. No, no, make a banana. Beck hates SpongeBob. Oh my gosh, it drives her insane. I just realized I don't have a recipe card and neither does Presley. Pres, can you jump out and move the trolley, please? Oh, we're moving a trolley? Yes, sure. Oh. Welcome to Presley's trolley moving class. So what you want to do, you want to walk over to the trolley, grab it by the handle, it may be infected with anything, you never know. And then you want to move it so that you can't go in between the cracks. Oh, damn it. Oh my gosh, that started going up. Uh... It's gonna go on the road and somebody is not gonna like their Range Rover after it's been crashed into a trolley. Okay, there's somebody there, but I think I can make a run for it. I probably just look like such a psychopath to some people. <laughs> All right, guys, so not only do you need to shop for your ingredients for your cakes, you also need any pans, aprons, whisks, any utensils that you might need for your cake as well. Okay. All right, are you ready? Yeah, how much money do you $30. $30. $30 budget. I can even, I can't even like do it. Timer starts as soon as Charlie ties up his shoelace. Come on. What? You can't call my camera then. Bring up Charlie. All right, Empire fan, the challenge starts in three, two, one. Go, friends. What's up guys, so uh, we are at shopping and I have no idea where I am or if the camera's even facing me. It's five buckaroos. Good day, mate. <laughs> you know what, I'm taking this off. I'm probably wasting so much time right now. It's $1.50, that's decent. Yes, mum's helping me. Well, I need these Christmas stuff. It's not a, it's October. So I need rectangular pans, two of them. And we are off. Foot scene? I don't remember when the last time we did a foot scene was. They should be having Halloween things in here. Bruh. Very fancy, not sponsored. It's got quite a big barcode. I've never seen a barcode as big as my face. Five dollars? I found Mr. Whiskey. Yeah. That's cute. I was just casually avoiding some strangers. That might help you with making some little yeah, mini yeah, cakes or something. Like, um, a whisk, we need something to stir it with. Which ones? I only sell one, that doesn't matter. One on its own? Yeah. Oh, you need two. They're lobsters, lobsters. Corners. No, you're animals. Corny. 
<laughs> Why am I walking through the shoe section, you might ask me? Because I am lost. I need a giant spoon, do I? Uh, do you? I definitely should have bought my phone. I'll, I'll need some of these. I'm following Charlotte because she's got the help of Beck. Okay, I've stolen Charlotte's oven mitt. I don't know why you need two oven mitts. You can do it with just one, but uh. <laughs> Wait! Oven mitt somewhere. You put it somewhere? Yeah, I don't know where it is. I threw it into the pillows. Go and get the oven mitt, we'll see. No, Charlie, you stay. Let's go back and go get the oven mitt and then back. Okay guys, so we've only got five minutes to go to the fruit shop. Oh look, build a bear! That is so cool guys. Oh my gosh. Uh, Prev, I think we better go. Yeah. Come on. Welcome to Woolies. Um, where are the boxes though? Because you know me, I'm a simple person. So, ooh, vanilla cake mix or chocolate? No cake. Oh, banana cake. Okay, so I've got two banana cakes already. So let's put that into the trolley. Should I get blue oh, fruit? Supreme lemon. Oh, the look, that one's got sprinkles in it. And it's only so cramped. There's a strawberries and cream flavor. Social distancing. I haven't seen anything, any signs that say gluten free or anything. Where is food coloring? Food coloring. Do, 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 do. Guys, you know I went past that before and I was like, no way, not the health section. But gluten free is like healthier, so yeah. So I'm headed to the lolly section to get some pineapple lollies. I'm coming down, guys. There I you mean, go, Chi Chi. How could somebody not see that? How many do we need of those? A few? Um, two. Two? Okay. Three, actually. Three of those? It, it's pretty big. Okay, let's get three. So I just completely missed the candy aisle. Yeah, I need some eggs. Wait, is that is that a pineapple? No, that's just a gummy baby. Do we need the eggs that come from the chicken Yeah, Well, yes, all eggs come from the chickens. We need free range eggs, that's what we buy. I've got these unicorn confettis and they're so cute. There's like three people just crowded around the M&M's and I want to get some M&M's. But there's people crowded around them. Um, guys, we've only got a little bit of time. I'm gonna go to the candy section. That's fine. I've entirely lost my family. <gasps> candy, candy, candy. Where's candy? Where's, Where's the candy section? Found her. I'm gonna go get her. She saw me running to her and then just left. I'm very bad with aisle. Alright, press Sally. You've got yes. one minute left. What? One minute. How am I to do One minute. Do I need to bring these guys? Let it go. Yeah. I'm like running into all these people. Hey, Char, is Mum over here? Yeah, she's okay. over here. We, we gotta yes. get to Mum before the time runs out. <laughs> oh, yes, yes. <laughs> done, done. Oh, There's the stuff. You just made it. Oh my gosh. You. Yes. Okay, present Charlie, you've got all your ingredients. Yeah. Your two hours cooking time starts in three, two, one, go. Okay, so we got eggs. Okay. Baby, set the timer. Yes. All right, we've got two hours on the clock. All right, there we go, Empire Fam. Ooh, we might have to use these in a challenge later. I've got a lot of cake here. I've just got SpongeBob SquarePants things on. Two so eggs, right now. two, three, six. I'm six so eggs? Yes, yeah, six eggs. All right, how are we going, Prez? I'm going through, I'm just cutting this box open. How are they looking, Char? Great. Good. 60 grams times three, that's 180 grams of, it looks, it feels like I want to make a show. Guys, this looks like an egg train. Oh my gosh. Chugga 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 Got it? Yes. Oh, one-handed egg cracking. Oh, hold on. So you're watching this Gordon Ramsay? Don't hire me to cook. Where's your fight, man? What about the butter that's about to explode? <laughs> what Anybody? About to explode, Mom. I'm scared it's going to be too hot. Where's your little mittens that you bought? Oh, you can use a tea towel, that's fine. Careful. All right, guys, that's Charlie's butter there. So that's the special butter. How are you going, Prez? Um, I just need two cups of milk. Okay, and then mix it all in. Sorry if you're trying to um, listen to what Charlotte's saying, you know. Okay. I know, you're very noisy over there. I need to be doing the butter. I'm mad at this. Why are you measuring it? It's one cup. You're meant to measure, Charlie. It's how you cook. Oh, boom. 
All right, guys, we're 20 minutes in. Oh my gosh, this smells like banana flavor. Pres, don't spend too much time playing with your food. You don't have much time left. Go, quick. All right, Chachi, you're greasing the pan. What's your brother doing? Jumping. Pres, you're tall enough to see up there. I can't see at the top, and that's where you keep all the sprays. Guys, Pres is wasting his time looking for spray that doesn't exist. There's no spray, love. You use butter to grease the pan with. Look at your sister. I don't know that. That looks good, chat. Presley's watching closely. Oh. What's wrong? A little bit more butter. I don't want it to stick because I've seen I nailed it. People just don't grease their pan. Charlie's ready. <laughs> You're ready to go in the oven, Char. Careful, it's all very hot. Good girl. Finally. All right, let's go, Pres. Oh, that looks good. It kind of looks like cookie dough to me. Oh my gosh, it does. Oh no. Oh, that's a good, oh my gosh. What are you getting up there? I'm getting these for my cupcakes. Oh, I thought you were gonna make the little unicorn ones. Yeah. No, the unicorn ones, the little cakes. Oh. Look, hey guys, who's got a birthday coming up? Mm, me. No, me. you what that way. Nice. This one, he's gonna be a teenager. <laughs> Prez is gonna be 13. How do you feel? <laughs> She's gonna try and steal your limelight, Prez. It's just the way it's gonna be. <laughs> 17th of November, 2007, six o'clock in the morning. <laughs> to be exactly, precisely okay. 13 years old. What's your birthday goal, Prez? I want to get to 500,000 Pretzel Army members by my birthday. I want to see if we can actually do that. That's a pretty good goal. Yeah, we're really close. We're like 50,000 subscribers away. So guys, hit that subscribe button on my channel, please. All right, but first guys, make sure you subscribe to the Empire Fam. Yeah, join the fam here first, guys. Then head over to Prez's yeah. channel and join the Pretzel Army over there. And Chi Chi. Have you decided on a name for your army or your squad yet? No, I'm thinking like Chachi squad. All right guys, go check out Charlie's channel as well. She does some cool videos over there as well. And she does a bit of gaming on there too, don't you Chachi? Yeah. Here's what we're filming. Just find out All right guys, Can so Chris and Charlie are doing a story for Instagram. If you haven't followed us guys, go check out our Instagram. The kids do stories on it all the time. We've just stolen these from the kids. And we're gonna do a challenge where you have to throw an egg. And I have to catch it in their mitten. This could end up bad for us. The winner of the challenge gets a special oh. bonus. Oh, did that just literally arrive? Oh, yes! Guys, here's the pizza. No, they don't do gluten free pizza there, but we got you something else instead. Just there. Yes! Thank you. Pres and Charlie, who wants some extra time in the challenge? Me! Pres? Do you want some extra time, Pres? Um, we have a little song. How do I get it? You can win an extra three minutes' time in That's this challenge. Yes! If you have like 10 seconds extra, that's like, that saves your life. That's like an hour extra. Okay, the challenge is guys, you'll take one of your oven mitts each that mummy is beautifully modeling here. Show us your little modeling lobster hand. Today, Charlotte's going to have the lobster Bye. themed one. And I'm going to throw an egg at the person that drops their egg first is out. The rules are pretty easy. Are you ready? Yep. Three. Two, one. Oh, oh, can you use your chest? Yes. Aww. Three, two, one. Right. I believe I can fly. Oh, yeah. Cha! What I happened? Can't catch an egg. That means, Chachi, I'm sorry to say you don't get the three minutes extra time. Oh. Everybody dance now. Guys, let's go see where Charlie went. <laughs> Shasha! Come out from there! Come on! Come on! Grab my hand. Come on, Baba. You only dropped an egg, you only missed out on three minutes. It just means you've got to work faster and harder. Let's go. Okay, so Prez, you've got an extra three minutes time at the end. Yep. And Charlie, you need to work super fast, Bob. You ready? Let's do what it. Do do All right, so now we need to start getting our things ready to decorate. What do I do? Um, I just like put this on the table. All right, guys, there's a twist. You can have five minutes mum help time, but you only get to pick one mum and she has to help both of you at the same time. Now. Yeah. No! I feel a little bit rejected, but I am You're not good at other things. I'm good at other things. You're really, you're really, really good at driving the car. <laughs> <laughs>
All right, guys, five minutes of mommy time starts in three. Where's Ava? She's getting her egg cream. Oh, Come on, oh. I got it. Press no. I got it. No fighting. He, he, he stole it. No fighting. No fighting. I didn't have it. <laughs> Five minutes of mummy time starts in three, two, one, go. <laughs> I'm a pizza bit. <laughs> you're not making a pizza. So Shah, for your unicorn, you remember what the picture looks like? Okay, so we're gonna roll this out so it fits over there. Then we're gonna put that cake underneath when it comes, yes? Yeah? It's hard and like this. I know, you've got to warm it up. Mum, I just, mum, yeah. down. Okay, I need the rolling pin and how do I flatten this out? Hey Shah, look at that. Someone's gonna get hurt. Stop. Sha, don't. No, because if he lets go, you'll go flying. Three minutes left of mummy help time. All right, so what color is yours? Yours is white? Yeah. Like maybe five drops. Yep. And now roll it. It's a workout, Prez. Woo! <laughs> We're having fondant trouble. This fondant has been out too long. How are they going, honey? They're going really good. They're I'm really good. good. They're, yes, you are. Do you think they need more mummy time? Are they good? <laughs> They've got it, they've got it. Probably. Yeah, this looks amazing. Chachi, how are you going? Good, I'm you... making the eyelashes. Oh, nice. Quick ask you questions now, guys. You've got 10 I'm seconds gonna, left. I'm a tiny bit of water just to put this all together like that at the end. See you, Mum. Love you. Thanks for the help. I'm using it. I, he stole it. That's not fair. While she wasn't using it, that is fair. That's good. Oh. Nailed it. All right, you keep looking at them. It's not working really Oh, well. that's pretty good. So I'm going to do the cone now. The horn. Really cool. The horn. The unicorn the horn. horn. Yeah. <laughs> that looks good, Chachi. So you've got to get multicolored sprinkles. So instead of hundreds and thousands, you're going with unicorn sprinkles. Actual unicorn sprinkles, guys. If you look really closely, they're actual little unicorns. And then I can put them on there like that. That looks good, Chachi. Are you happy with the horn? Yes. All right, Perez, where are you up to? I'm just making the like parts that go around the tie. The little collar? Yeah, the collar. All right, so this is the part Perez is making right now, guys. Just there, the little collar and the little teeth as well. I just put that there. Oh, look at his eyes. That's oh my really gosh. good. That's so cute. Chachi, your cake looks really good. Thanks. SpongeBob's getting some eyelashes, guys. This cake actually looks really good, Perez. Except it doesn't look like SpongeBob. So I've put the horn on and the eyes on, and I wish the fondant was a little bit smoother, but it's going really good. I'm just putting some water on. His face is looking good. Thank right, you. you guys can have an upside down view for now. There you go. <laughs> All right, Chachi, those are your little ears? Yeah. They look really cute. What are they made out of? Um, they're made out of fondant, ice cream cones, and pickles. Yeah. You've only got five minutes left. What? what? There is one more challenge. Another challenge? I'm doing so bad right now. Present Charlie, for the final challenge. Yeah? Yes. If you're the winner, Presley, you get to keep your three minutes extra time. Woo! But if Charlotte wins this challenge, she gets to steal your three minutes extra time. Okay, that's just unfair. Come on, I get Okay guys, so this is a speed round. Okay. So I'm gonna show you 10 items from the kitchen drawer and you have to say what they're called as quickly as you can. If you get it right, you get a point. There's the first one to five points. Are we using items. like buzzers? No, you just have to call out what it is. Okay. Go. Can I can I can I oh, one to press. Oh, it's a draw. Set. Whisk, whisk. Oh, you're nearly there, Cheech. Okay. Ice cream scooter. Ice cream scooter. All right, is that four to press? That's not fair. Right. But was it one point each for the pizza cutter? No, I said no, no points. points. All right, guys, so Perez is on four. Charlie is yet to get a point. But Charlie, if he guesses the next one before you, he wins the round and he keeps his three minutes. Are you ready, Char? Come on, Chi Chi. Yeah. You gotta beat him, you ready? All right, look at mum's hand. Ready, set. Cheat knife. She's on fire. And she was bringing it up, I saw it. That was fast. Top, wait, no, no, no. Um, oh. it's a tea, tea, tea brewer. Yeah, that's okay. good, tea brewer. Tea strainer, but is it? Close, close. Two to four, let's go, three, two, one. Spatula. Oh, four to three. Charlie's coming back. Three, two, one. It's a wooden spoon! Oh, she finished it before you. Guys, that's four all. All right, this is it, guys. This is the final round. Whoever gets this gets the extra three minutes time, which you both clearly will need, you do need. for the challenge. Two, one. It's Who's the cherry cutter? Cherry peeler! Cherry peeler! Cherry peeler! Cherry peeler! 
All right, Prez, this is looking pretty good. Thank you, I'm almost done. He's putting the tie on, guys. How cute does that look? 57 seconds left. Prez, that means you have three minutes and 57 seconds left. Oh my goodness, Chachi, that looks amazing. Oh my gosh, is that gold, Cheech? Yeah. As soon as you hear the bell, Chichi, done? Yep. Oh, perfect timing, there you go, well done. It is really good. That's a compliment. That's my first ever compliment from Charlotte. Thank you. I thought you were going to say first ever compliment ever. <laughs> <laughs> Seven seconds. As soon as you hear the buzzer, time's up. How are you going? Um, I've been the cables. Oh, time's up. Okay, Empire fans, so you guys are actually voting for who the best chef is. So look really closely, look at all the little details and tell us who you think is the best chef today. I'm ready to reveal them. All right, Charlie, you're looking pretty proud there with a big smile on your face. Yeah. How are you feeling? I'm feeling really good. I think, I thought before it was gonna turn out really bad because it looked really hard. But I mean, I'm not saying it was easy, but yeah, um, yeah I think it turned out really good. Now then, three, two, one. This is my cake, guys. It is awesome. I'll give you the grand tour of my unicorn cake. Just can can I just acknowledge the way you say grand instead of grand? I like it. Grand. I want to give you the grand tour. It's very grand. It's very posh. It's like dance and dance. I like the way you say it. Let's just put a picture up next to this guy so everybody can remember what you're trying to match your cake to. Nailed it. So there we go, guys. On the left, you'll see the one that Charlie needs to match, and on the right, you'll see Charlie's one. I think she's done a pretty great job. So, so pretty, Charlie. You did an amazing job, Charlie, and I actually really like that you added your own little unique touch to it. I really like these little edible chocolate unicorns on the side. I think that was yeah. really cool. Please vote for me. <laughs> Turn around, touch the ground, Jim's Empire fan, vote for me. And. If you vote for me, comment down below or on the community page or Instagram, Miss Charlie Unicorns. All right, guys, so there's a picture of what Presley's cake is meant to look like, and let's see what his turned out like. You ready, Pres? Three, two, one, nailed it! <laughs> what was that? <laughs> so this is SpongeBob SquarePants. It looks just like SpongeBob SquarePants from the cartoon. It's got like all the little details, including the teeth, the tongue, every little thing, including- What are you giggling about? <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? It's got every little detail and it's also a yellow banana flavoured cake, which is really, really good. Right, what do you got, Prez? B O T E <laughs> Vote for me! <laughs> Yay! Go, Presley! Go, Presley! All right, Empire fam, go cast your votes. We need to know who you guys think was the best chef today. And guys, don't forget to subscribe and join the fam. We're nearly at 100k, so make sure you're part of the 100k squad, guys. Yes. Yeah, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace! Peace.